back to school season for most of us is a little bit annoying, but at the same time, it's the perfect time for reorganizing our rooms, adding some new furnitures and technologies, and getting rid of some of them. But sometimes it's easier if we have a design at our hand before moving the real objects. Some 3D design apps like SketchUp are very handy in this kind of situation, but I don't think we wanted to learn a new software just to organize our room. Hi everyone, this is Majid, Digital Creation Specialist at One Public Library. And today I wanted to show how you can use our beloved friend Tinkercad to arrange your space. Let's dive in. So today we are going to learn about a specific collection on Tinkercad which is designed for our purpose, I mean using a furniture collection. Then we are going to search for free 3D design fonts on some websites and at the end we are going to import those fonts inside Tinkercad and try to adjust them for our purpose. If you search for 3D design free fonts or 3D STL fonts or these kind of keywords, you will find probably over 30 different websites you can download fonts for free. Let's uh, very quickly look into them. So Thingiverse is the first location probably you search for a free font. You don't need to sign up, you can just download any font you want. Cult also is a famous one, not as old as Thingiverse, but you can find uh, lots of fonts on the call. My Mini Factory is another website. Uh, you can find designs in different sections, different topics. And you Imagine is another website. You can find very cool designing or a collection of designing. Here again on Tinkercad and I'm going to change the name of that to Room Furniture. And I'm going to start designing my, my room. Suppose the whole word plane is the size of my room, but always you can use ruler here to make exactly what size of the work plan you wanted to assign for um, the room. Even you can add walls. So these are things you already know, so I'm not spending so much time on that. And I'm not going to use the wall, I'll just show you how you can do that. So it's totally up to you if you wanted to use the walls. Even you can add windows to the walls and uh, door and those kind of things. So it's totally up to you. Okay, so, but here on the right side on Shape Generate, if I click on this drop-down menu, there are other options, and one of them is OMSI Hangout Space, something like that. And you see that there is a collection of furniture here. Different colors, different sizes, different shapes. So it's totally up to you. You can bring, for example, I wanted to bring, uh, these are left coach, but probably I wanted to bring a large seat in the back. And uh, unfortunately, these, uh, the size of these uh, furnitures are set, so I cannot resize those. Now I'm going to bring different furnitures on work plane and see uh, which set is the best, deleting some of them, bringing others to get the best result.
but these are not enough i have other things at my room so that's the reason i'm going to search and find some items on thingiverse you can use other website but i prefer to use thingiverse so i found a couple of items and i'm going to download it if you remember that you should go to uh, think find and see if the file is in STL format just click on download and have it so this is one item a bookshelf so another drawers probably it's a little bit fancy but I like it and there is a refrigerator probably it's not bad to add a refrigerator to my room now I have all of those fonts ready to be imported to uh, Thinkercad. Now this is the time for importing those fonts inside my room. So I'm going to import and importing one by one. As you see, I imported a couple of those files. You see, even I copy that bookshelf, made another one and then group them together. So there are other things you can do. You can change the color based on what you want. For example, this one is yellow. If you wanted to change it to something probably closer to the, the range of colors here, you can pick another one. But you know, I don't have any talent in interior designing. So this is something you can do definitely better than me. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. We love to see your creativity by using these tutorials, softwares, applications. Please remember to share it with us by using hashtag VPL at home. See you soon.